my beloved love. And just like that bird learning to fly, the push here is meant to help them discover their own inner ability to lift their vibration. Because I do feel as though this person was actually utilizing you as a bridge to their own spiritual connection. Of course, they don't seem to be a person who is very interested in spiritual topics or materials. So, to this person, in their own words, they would probably say that being around you makes them feel a certain way. And that's really a key phrase here. They will say things like, Talking to you makes me happy, or you make me smile so much, or you always make me feel better. And of course, there is nothing wrong with having these other beautiful souls in our life who support our happiness and positive feelings. But the issue with this particular person is again, it's almost like they were using you as a bridge to their own happiness. And the thing about it is, I feel like this person wasn't even really appreciative of you or grateful to you for being that bridge. Because they were not even consciously aware that they were using you in that way, and I get that feeling as well from your energy. Whoever I am speaking to here, you may have felt very used by this person or by whatever this situation is that's coming up. For some of you, this cleansing of your life energetically may not even necessarily be a specific person. There is a chance that this could be a job being cut out of your life. This could be a kind of opportunity somehow just didn't work out. Whatever this thing is though, what you need to know is you are being divinely protected. Of course, there is that phrase that rejection is divine protection. But I do feel like, because you are someone who always keeps an open heart chakra center, you are someone who walks around with an open heart, and therefore you can trust what enters your life and, in this case, what is leaving your life. This has been a major theme as well in recent reading videos. Those of you who do tune into our Monday, Wednesday, Friday collective readings are very much aware of this kind of Queen of Swords energy, this cutting people out or the divine cutting people out of your life kind of energy that's been coming through recently. If you are new here and you aren't familiar with my reading style, I do channel general collective readings on Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So, I do recommend tuning in on those times and days if it feels aligned for you because we also have a live chat feature during those events. The live chat is particularly powerful because this is where we can all interact as a community and of course you are all co-creators here, sharing your own beautiful unique soul frequency with the channel. So, by doing that through the live chat, we are actually, in a sense, manifesting for each other, mutually uplifting and supporting each other at that vibrational level. Type yes if you believe in God. God bless you.